to make this simple motor, you will need a battery, an iron nail, a wire, and a neodymium magnet. First, place the magnet under the nail head. The magnet magnetizes the nail and then the battery so they can hang like this. And then we touch one end of the wire to the top of the battery, the other end of the wire to the side of the mag magnet. I put a piece of tape on the nail to better help us to see the spin. Let's see. We can also touch the side of the magnet like this. Or on the other side like this. The spinning direction stays the same. But guess what happens when we flip the direction of the battery? Now the spinning direction changes. And what if we switch the direction of the magnet? If we flip the magnet over, see the spinning direction flips again now let's see how this motor works in this setup the electric current comes out of the positive terminal of the battery and into the negative, so the electric current goes to the left over here. The magnet has north on the top, and the magnetic field lines go out of the north into the south, so the magnetic field goes downward out here. We know that the magnetic force on an electric current is I L cross B. I L cross B gives me an out-of-the-paper magnetic force. This is the magnetic force on the current. So its equal and opposite reaction force on the magnet goes into the paper. This into the paper magnetic force on the left side of the magnet provides a torque that makes the magnet spin in such a direction. When I switch the wire contact to the front of the magnet, the top view is like this. The current goes to the left. The magnetic field lines coming out of the north into the south will go into the paper. L cross B would give me a downward magnetic force on the current. So the equal and opposite reaction force on the magnet would go upward. This upward magnetic force on the left side of the magnet would make the magnet spin clockwise same as this. When I switch the wire contact to the back side of the magnet, the top view is like this. The current goes to the left, the magnetic field goes into the paper. I L cross B gives me a downward magnetic force on the current, so the equal and opposite reaction force on the magnet would go upward. This upward magnetic force on the left side of the magnet would make the magnet spin clockwise, same as before. When I switch the polarity of the battery, the current would flow in the opposite direction, so the magnetic force would flip direction, so the motor would rotate the other way. If I also switch the polarity of the magnet, the magnetic field would go in the opposite direction, so the magnetic force would flip back to the original direction, and the motor would rotate in the original direction again. 